What's up guys? This is the Awesome Nerd Show and today we have another unboxing and it is the nerd block for this month. Now once again, as always, I have absolutely no clue what the theme is for this month so we'll just have to go with it. Um, I keep missing out on stuff. Um, but it so far it looks cool for both of me. Um, so first off we have a shirt. Um, we'll see what it is. So it's obviously a diamond. It looks like there's a link uh, shining off on the inside of it. So it's obviously a um, Legend of Zelda shirt. Um, don't know what it's from exactly or anything, but uh, because we've never really played the games and stuff, but it still looks pretty cool and a wearable shirt and stuff, so that's not bad. Um, so I'll sit that aside. Um, next we have a Dorbs, and it is, I uh, can't remember his name, Star Lord. <laughs> Good, I kept wanting to say Star Killer, but it is Star Lord from Guardians of the Galaxy and stuff, and I believe we already have this, um, so we may keep this one in the box or something. Um, but yeah just the star lord dorbs it's kind of weird that they did this so late but i don't know i guess once we figure out the theme we'll understand why but it seems really late to include a gardens of galaxy thing in it but um so next up it looks like we obviously have a poster of some sort and it says it's a treasure map so i have to see what kind of maybe it's from goonies or something and it's one-eyed willie's treasure map um so it definitely doesn't look like that. I don't know what this is, if it's um, from Uncharted, possibly. I don't know, because that's a lot of popular stuff right now. Um, but I don't know, it's a map of something, and I do see a skull up here in the top. Um, but I don't know what it is. So I'll have to look to see. Um, I'm looking at the little readings on it. I don't see anything that looks familiar. I don't know. We'll just, like I said, definitely have to look at the thing and see what it's from. Because I have absolutely no clue. Um, next we have a bookmark. It's a Harry Potter bookmark with the Gryffindor crest on it. So we can obviously use this for reading purposes. Like reading the Harry Potter books. Like the new one that's going to be coming out soon. The Cursed Child or whatever the book is called. And so it's this, um, of course, real heavy uh, crest on top. And then it's got this um, like flat type thing with the Gryffindor logo on it and just like a red thing, uh, um, red background underneath. So together it makes the color and stuff. So that's a really nice bookmark. Don't know how well it'd be staying a book, especially having this top and it'd probably just like fall right out, but can still try it anyways. Um, and then it looks like the last thing we have is a book and it says Tobin's Spirit Guide and it's official Ghostbuster book that says written by um, I'm assuming it's supposed to be Stan Spangler and Burnman. I don't know if it's because it's got Egon uh, Spangler and stuff. So I don't know if it's supposed to be like all the characters from the sh uh, movies or whatever, um, or what. But it looks like it's just a book on different types of like ghosts and demons and everything and stuff. So there's like Poltergeist and stuff. So that's a cool um, book. Um, probably have to scare Bro with it a little, get into his possession fears. Um, then it looks like the last thing we have is a Game of Thrones. I don't know if I'm missing them, but it's a Game of Thrones Daenerys Targaryen. It says Copper of Mirin, but it's a coin and it's got, I don't know if you can possibly see it. Um, if I can get this out of here. But it's got a picture of Daenerys and the dragons. Um, on one side, I don't know if you can possibly see that. Kind of, a little, I don't know, it's hard to see. But it's got her on one side and then it's got um, like the uh, pyramid temple thing with the breaking chain, so like the um, slaves that she freed, or whatever, but it says breaker of chains and then Targaryen, or Daenerys Targaryen, queen of the Meereen or what, I don't know how to say the name stuff. But that's a cool little coin stuff and it's got this little like package thing. Um, to put in with some information on it so that looks like that is all the items and of course we have another one of these cards that we don't know why we get in all of them um, looks like there is some sort of shirt punch thing I'm not sure so it looks like there's a code on here that you could possibly use and it's just a $10 credit on shirt punch um, the next month's uh, uh, theme is has I don't know what the theme is, but um, this 
has Suicide Squad, Transformers, and Attack on Titan. So obviously if you like any of those, you can order um, the Nerd Block for next month. And so now we have um, our information thing. And it, of course, does not say what the theme is for this one. Like, of course it would. But it looks like you got um, one of three uh, Legends of Zelda shirts. So we, of course, got the green one. But there's also the blue and red. Um, and the map just says... So it, it says it is a Goonies map. Um, I don't really remember that map in Goonies, but it may have just not paid attention enough to it. Um, so there was that. Then you could have got um, either Star-Lord or Groot out of the Dorbs. And then it looks like there were two versions of the coin. So you could have got um, uh, the, um, tar or the Targaryen or possibly the Lannister one. Although it's got a wolf on it, so I would assume, I would think the Starks or something. But anyways, not that it really matters. Um, but that's going to be it for the nerd block this month. So bro, what was your favorite item out of this box? Uh, the door? Question mark? Yeah, this wasn't one of their best boxes, so the Dorb is um, obviously really cool. I mean, even though we do have it already, it's still cool to get Dorbs and Pops and all that sort of stuff in the box. Um, but I think my choice would probably be this book, because it actually looks like a book um, that I'd actually read. Um, and I think it'd be interesting to see all the um, different types of ghosts and ghouls and stuff. And hey, look, there's Slimer. I found Slimer. Um, so like I said, not the best box for this month, um, or I guess not the best box this month in general um so that's gonna be it for the nerd block don't forget to like subscribe and comment um check out our other um, unboxing videos and gaming videos and we'll see you next time